this is like the most awkward like ever <laughs> i would try to zoom in but oh my gosh you guys i'm so excited about all these gray hairs look at them can you see them i don't know if you can but they're getting look at them they're like getting long now oh my gosh it's like hard to show you guys i hope you can see them oh my gosh look at that i'm so excited I don't know that many people that get that excited over gray hair, but I do. I'm excited. I want to see like if I'll get like some cool like silver patch or something. <laughs> anyway, that is why I will not like color my hair on the top with anything more than like a demi because I want to, I don't want to cover them up when they come in. Like, I don't mind, like, taking my end slider or something, but I don't want to cover my gray. Is that crazy? Also, I am totally breaking my rule today. Like, I went and brushed my teeth like I normally do, but that's just weird to me not to because, I don't know, it just grosses me out not to. But I'm not having a cup of water and stuff. I'm going straight for the coffee today because rules can be broken. But this is the creamer I'm using oat creamer it's pistachio cream and it's from i got it from earth fair so i'm gonna drink that so i just don't feel like having like a whole breakfast Ugh. and now that i'm like on this new like diet well dietary restrictions now i think i guess you have to count calories now Let me help her do what she's doing. Got it? Anyway, yeah, and then I put a little bit of this in it too. Um, yeah, I'm not, I'm assuming I'm vlogging today and that's what I'm doing because that's how the morning started out. And I need to do some skincare. I tried that e.l.f. Um, it's the balm. Let me show you. Mmm. It's the cleansing balm, and I used it when I was in Ohio. Oh, my God. I'm sorry for these angles, y'all. I used it when I was in Ohio, and it, it's very creamy, and I think I didn't realize that it's just supposed to be, like, a balm to, um, like, to remove your makeup. I think I used it as a cleanser because that's all that I had, and <laughs> matching ones now. It's this, but it does really work. I've been looking for the ones to work like um, that Clinique, the balm from Clinique. I was, I want some of that. Let me turn some of these lights on. And anyway, yeah, so I don't know what we're going to do today. <laughs> I don't know. I'm just a vloggy vlogging. I think I'm going to have my coffee and then I'm debating on going to the gym. I'm kind of sore not as sore today, but um, debating on going to the gym or resting because I do pretty much now I've been working out pretty much every day, at least for 20 minutes, if not mostly an hour, if not at least 20 minutes. So I don't know, I might get on my bike. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. Stay tuned. Okay, so I'm going to finish reading Joshua in the Bible. I don't know if some of y'all do this, but sometimes I'll just ask like, I'll just pray and ask God, like, what does he want me to read or whatever? And Joshua came to mind. And honestly, I forgot it was even a book in the Bible. So I started that. And it's just crazy to me. Like, I don't know. Like, I just am thinking, like, it's so wild that we have words from God in a book that we can read. And I'm just like, I know, I'm crazy. But anyway, <laughs> um, I think it's just wild that we can do that, that we could just read it. And you definitely have to pray to understand what's going on because some of it is like really hard to digest, you know? Um, but yeah, I was reading this one thing where Joshua, where he, the, the, the guy showed up with the sword and uh, Joshua fell and worshiped him. And I was like, well, it can't be an angel because they don't worship angels. The angels always say like, don't worship us. And this guy didn't. And I was like, was that Jesus? Like, because you know Jesus appeared to them 
in his different form in the Old Testament than he does in the New Testament. So I'm like, it's just wild. So I think I'm going to read that and then figure out what I'm going to do. I was thinking about curling my hair. It's getting really dry. I need a haircut. <sighs> so yeah, I'm going to do that. And then maybe we'll play in some makeup. All right, guys. So all right, plan for the day. I didn't finish reading. My brain will not let me read right now. So I'm going to, I'm going to go to the gym with my daughter. We have a rec center where I live and it's free if you live here and it's amazing. So we're going to go walk the track, maybe play some basketball, you know, something. Um, but I wanted to jump on here and tell y'all, look what I found. Listen, I went to um, the Ulta in Ohio in Columbus. I don't know which one it was. Maybe it was at the Polaris Mall and they had this Winky Lux which is the cutest name, by the way. I mean, look at the packaging. How freaking adorable. This is what it is. It is a, a gentle vitamin C exfoliator, which I love to do exfoliate my face. Like I wash my face with one of those spinny brushes and it's amazing. My face feels so smooth. And then I got, um, they had this one, the Winky Lux. The packaging though, y'all. And then this is the packaging for the Dream Jelly Moisturizing Face Gel. <sighs> Love it. Oh, I'm gonna show it to you. Oh my gosh. Um, it's like that kind of, but I love it. So I decided to wash my face. I showered last night, but I was like, let me wash my face and put some of this on. And then I'll come home and like, I guess shower again. And then maybe we can do some makeup. But I just feel like a vloggy kind of day. Also, I need to figure out like some things in my house. And maybe I'll take you guys along and you can um, kind of help me decide what to do. Because the room that I'm filming in right now. This was my son's old bedroom turned into our office, which has now turned into my filming room slash catch everything kind of room. And I'm just trying to debate if I want to take all my filming stuff upstairs and maybe turn this back into like a bedroom or... I don't know. The only problem that I have is my bedroom has slanted ceilings. So there's like no full wall space whatsoever. And that's why I think it's easier to film here because I have like, um, you know, a wall I can stand up against if I'm doing like fashion stuff, which I don't really think you guys vibe too much with the fashion stuff. Like it seems like people on my channel kind of like the makeup and the vlogs, but Dude, let me turn y'all around and show y'all what I'm dealing with. Okay, so this is my filming setup for when I do makeup, okay? My little mirror, my wall, that was gonna be a reading nook. This is the bane. My catch-all table has still got the fur coats on it. Random blanket, dog stuff, workout stuff, a little desk, that janky window, my husband's desk that has become his he collects baseball cards. So there are baseball cards everywhere. My nail stuff is on here. Like it is just jank city over here. So I'm like, do I just, cause look at that. Oh, I can't stand it. But our house does not have closets. So that's a problem. Um, and I just don't know what to do. So I, and upstairs, like we did, um, I don't know. I have to carry all upstairs, but I'm just like, I don't know if I should like, I don't know what to do. Like I need it clean and orderly and this room just gets it. Like you don't know where to put it. We come put it in here. Like <sighs> Help. I need those organizers. You know what I'm talking about? Like those, those girls who come and organize your house and like they make build in built ins and stuff. That's who I need. One with my mini me to the gym. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> 
Okay, I forgot my inhaler. <laughs> anyway, I lifted some weights and I walked and now I'm sweating and I'm waiting for them to get out of the weight room. I don't know how people like drive and vlog. <sighs> but anyway, I don't know what I'm getting ready to do. I'm gonna go home and like make an apple chicken sausage, I think, and some mustard. But anyway, I think this is probably gonna be the end of the vlog, but I just want y'all to know in no way, shape, or form do I think that I'm going to take off 60 pounds that I put on over five years and 20 of that over the last like, maybe even 25, I don't know over the last like since COVID, so four years. So I in no way, shape or form think I'm going to just run to the gym for a month and eat healthy and think that I'm going to like lose all this weight. But I'm also not, um, what am I gonna say? <laughs> I also think that it's gonna take some time and I'm okay with that. So I know it's gonna be like a while. Um, but yeah, so I, this is not going to be like a fitness journey unless y'all got about a good two years to follow me. Cause I don't know how long this stuff takes, but I think it takes a bit. Like, I don't know. So however long it takes me, it takes me, but I want to get back down. I want to lose like at least 50 pounds. So anyway, <laughs> wish me luck. Love you guys. Bye. If you like Grandma's videos, then subscribe yet. <laughs>